Did you know that spinal fusion surgery can lead to muscle loss? This can result in chronic low back pain and increased risk for needing more spine surgery in the future. As a board certified neurosurgeon, let's discuss how to protect your back and stay strong long term. This is an MRI of the spine showing a cross-sectional view through a vertebrae. What you're seeing here is the deep muscle support system that plays a crucial role in spinal stability and movement. Each of these muscles serves a specific function. The multifidus is in the deepest layer and provides fine-tuned stability to the spine. The erector spinae muscles run along the back helping maintain posture and movement while the psoas connects the spine to the hips, playing a major role in mobility. When these muscles weaken, whether it's from injury, aging, or surgery, the spine loses this essential support. This has been directly linked to chronic low back pain and degeneration of the joints over time. In fact, studies have shown an association between facet joint arthritis and weakness of the multifidus muscle. When these muscles deteriorate, this may result in additional workload on the facet joints, accelerating wear and tear, inflammation, and painful movements. That's why preserving these muscles during surgery and strengthening them through targeted rehabilitation is essential for long-term spine health. A strong, well-functioning muscle support system can mean less pain, better mobility, and a lower risk of future complications. However, lumbar spine surgery especially a posterior lumbar fusion, presents unique challenges because it often leads to muscle weakening due to surgical retraction of the muscles, superficial nerve disruption, and immobilization after surgery during the recovery. When performing spine surgery, one of the most overlooked but critical factors in long-term recovery is the preservation of the paraspinal muscles, especially the multifidus and the erector spinae muscles. These deep stabilizers play a vital role in protecting your spine, supporting movement, and reducing mechanical stress on your joints. Excessive stripping or disruption can lead to increased post-operative pain, infection risk, and long-term complications like failed fusion or adjacent level disease, issues we actively work to prevent. So to help preserve muscle strength, surgeons can utilize advanced, minimally invasive techniques and sometimes different approaches to the spine. These approaches may reduce disruption to the key stabilizing muscles, ultimately promoting better post-surgical outcomes and a smoother recovery. By using strategic muscle sparing techniques, in addition to post-operative physical therapy, surgeons and therapists can help protect and build these stabilizing muscles, thus optimizing long-term spine health. Whether you're considering surgery or want to strengthen your back, Knowing the role of your paraspinal muscles is key to maintaining mobility and reducing pain. So let's take a look at this MRI. This is what healthy paraspinal muscles look like. Strong, dark muscle fibers providing stability. Now, compare that to these MRIs of patients who underwent lumbar fusion by surgeons who admittedly use older, faster approaches to the spine without regard for the surrounding muscles. Notice the lighter gray and white areas that's fat and scar tissue where muscle used to be. Though this can happen even after careful lumbar surgery, it can also happen when surgical techniques fail to protect these critical structures. Now, let's look at MRIs of a couple of my patients for whom I performed open approaches for posterior lumbar fusion surgery using techniques designed to spare muscle. I specifically picked cross sections of the MRI where you can see the screws in place, so there's no denying that this was a posterior approach for a lumbar fusion. As you can see, the paraspinal muscles remain strong, intact, and fully functional. This is the difference that precision, experience, and the right surgical approach can make. When these muscles are damaged, patients can experience chronic low back pain instability, and even accelerated degeneration of the areas of the spine adjacent to the surgical levels. That's why muscle sparing techniques are critical to ensure better recovery, lower risk of complications, and long-term spine health. Your spine surgery should set you up for a stronger, healthier future. 
not years of pain and complications. While muscle weakness can't always be fully prevented, the difference lies in the precision, expertise, and the right surgical approach. Every decision in the operating room matters and meticulous technique can dramatically reduce your risks. Protecting your muscles means protecting your recovery because when it comes to spine surgery, the goal isn't just healing, it's thriving. Your spine health matters and the right information can make all the difference. Follow for expert surgical strategies and real insights that empower you to make the best choices. And if you know somebody who could benefit from this, please share it. It could change their journey. And thank you for watching.